Hi guys, happy Saturday to everyone. I hope everybody's having a beautiful, blessed day. As for me guys, I am home doing absolutely housework, house chores, you know, changing bed sheets. I changed my curtains. I'm doing laundry. I like to change my bed sheets, my, you know, my curtains and I like to wash them and also, you know, um, other things, you know, I cooked, you know, all that type of stuff. Um, yeah, guys, so today I decided to come on. I wasn't going to come on and do a video. To those that are new, welcome to my channel. I am Marisol. I hope that you enjoy my video. And to all my faithful watchers, I love you guys. And thank you so very much for all you guys support. I love you guys to the moon and back. <laughs> um, so anyways, guys, today I wasn't going to do a video. <coughs> <clears throat> Excuse me, but I came on real. I wanted to come on real quick um, to change this little buggy girl. This is Charlemagne, and Charlemagne is gonna get a little. Um, actually, I like to dress Charlemagne in little outfits like this. I got her. She's fairly new to my collection. I got her while I was in Baltimore. Um, house and pet sitting for my son so I believe my son I think that was in May I think it was could have been May it could have been May that I got her I was over there and I was just like when I came home I think she was one of the babies that I had waiting for me I do believe that but anyways um, since she came, I don't know, for some reason, she has, like, this little, um, face where I like to put her, like, in little dresses like this, like, um, little, like, old-time dresses, a little fancy, not old-time, but, you know, like, little fancy, flary dresses, like, this type of theme dress, and I, um, you, as, hmm, as many clothes as I have, um, I'm sure I have a lot of these little dresses, but guys, I really like, at this point, um, with all the stuff that I have, I really don't know, you know, I don't have them all in one spot. They're like, God knows, I have to run into them, right? So, as I run into them, then I always, like, every time I see them, I put them aside for her. And, um, I had this little dress that I had pulled out for my Bella Ray. And I was like, oh, it's lavender. Lavender goes good with Bella Ray. But then I was today, I was like looking at it and I said, hey, that dress belongs to her. It would be perfect for her. You know what I'm saying? She's good at lavender too. And I'm sure that um, Bella Ray will not mind at all because I already have like, you know, Bella Ray is a twin, guys. This is her little rattle. She's always holding this rattle. Although I have a million rattles. I don't know. She loves that rattle. Um, uh, Bella Ray is a twin with Yara. And um, I have... I have quite a few outfits for both of them. You know, similar or the same outfits for both of them. But I have to show you guys. Now, before I show you guys this, these little onesies, I got to tell you guys, I am not a sports fanatic. Um, my brother, um, he lived with me for many years, and um, he played basketball. So, I used to go to all his basketball games. Of course, you know, the big sister, I had to, like, I supported him through the whole, you know, all his life of basketball and you know all that you know i really did support him through it and i used to enjoy really enjoy going to his games they were like so much fun um i did go to a knicks game on a date guys it was like one of the best dates i i mean i've been to many beautiful dates but i have to tell you i went on a date and it was a guy that took me out and he was a fan 
like a big Knicks fan and he had bought tickets for the Knicks game. And let me tell you guys, if I tell you, it was like front seats. So it was a, such a cool game. I've been to basketball get I mean, um, baseball games. Um, when I was in high school, I mean, I dated like the hottest guy and the most popular guy on the football team. And I, um, you know, football, football is like such a like barbaric you know game like i'd be just like cringing like they just be just they just go at it like they really do like honestly um when my son was in um junior high school his um his coach his uh gym gym coach or whatever gym teacher was my like so my 30 year old son has always been like he was born nine pounds six ounces he was he he looked he looked like he was three months when he was born okay so he's always been like my son is six six to 325 pounds okay that's how my son is he's like my son is a big dude guys he is a big guy look at how cute she looks it looks so cute on her. We gotta change this. And we're gonna spritz up her hair a little bit. <coughs> so yeah, so his his teacher was after him because he wanted him to be like in the football team. He wanted to be him to be like what is it, a quarterback or back a backliner or a, a back, I don't know, the guys that back up everybody and just like hold everybody down. And I was like, let me tell you, he was like, he was in my son's ear and my son was coming into me and let me tell you, I didn't go to school and I, I went to that teacher and I was like, let me tell you something, if my son comes to me talking about freaking football and you talking to him about how great he could be in it, one more time i'm gonna come here and i'm gonna like kill you in front of all your kids and you're just gonna die like it's gonna be blood all over the place okay like i'm puerto rican and we carry knives so you better back the hell up my son is not gonna play no damn football because i'm an only parent and i'm not gonna be taking care of a no like that's like to me like let me tell you no it's too scary I like no no like I do like my friend does like when it's like football night or whatever and he's just like a great cook like he's like my brother and he invites me over and I go because of the food <laughs> I'm honestly saying the truth my I be and he knows it he's my he's my brother I'd be like I'm gonna go because you're a badass cook and I go for the food but he has like this huge TV and I just be crunching, me and his sisters, like, we be crunching, we be like, oh my God, they're gonna kill each other. Except for one of his sisters that she's like, like a, she's she's like such a sports chick, you know? And, and I get it, I understand, you know? Like, listen, I get it, I'm not knocking the sport. I'm just like, it's not for me. Like, I'm just a girly girl and I just worry about people getting hurt, you know? But I get it. I get it. I get that that's what men like, and I even women. I like. I know that women. A lot of women like the sports, and they they're into that. I get it. But it's just like like I said, it's not something that you know that I that I that, that I like or that I would want my son coming home. You know, like basketball, I was cool with. You know, I was cool with. Like, you know what I'm saying? But baseball, I'm cool with. But soccer no um you know i mean soccer i'm cool with too but um how you call it um football that's too rugged for me i mean i'm just like i just worry i just worry someone's gonna get hurt <laughs> you know what i'm saying so anyways the reason why i'm saying that is because i'm not a sports fan and i don't know anything about teams so i don't know <laughs> i don't know if this team rocks or not and I don't know, oh, I guess it's a football team. I was going to say, I don't know if it's a basketball team or, or, or a football team, but I guess it is because it has a football here. So it's the Packers. But look at how cute 
and these were gifted to me and I, I just washed them they just dried and you, aren't they the aren't they so so stinking cute so I'm gonna put these on Yara and um oh yeah I could have known look the NFL of course <laughs> um so I'm gonna put these on um I'm just seeing that now guys I just washed them and I I hand washed them because I didn't want them to get ruined or stretched out and I don't know if the colors were gonna run so I like I kind of like washed them individually separately and then I washed them like with um more like kind of cold water and um yeah um and I put them to dry on a hanger separately but I think that they're so stinking cute and then I, I have them for Yara and um Bella Ray. so I don't know anything about you know football I don't know any, anything about the teams. I don't know if the Packers are like a hot team or not. But whether they are or not, go Packers, right? That's what I'm going to do. <laughs> so, oh, mommy, I was supposed to give you a diaper change. You see? Oh, this is a cute diaper. And you know what? I think that the diaper that I have is not going to fit her. Because I really broke her. <coughs> this is a cute diaper like oh my gosh did you ever get a diaper change i want to know because i don't have those diapers <laughs> i really don't i don't have these diapers at all i've never even seen this diaper in my life so she probably has never had a diaper in her life well not in the life that she's been with me so and then we're going to give her a small one because your mommy brought you a wrong one i think this is a size one so anyways guys the reason why i'm coming on i wonder if this is a one uh, you falling off the boppy girl oh, this will fit a great so guys the reason why i'm coming on because i wasn't going to come on today i was going to save this video for tomorrow or well, not this particular video but i was going to you know make a video for you guys tomorrow <coughs> excuse me so i was going to uh, make a video for you guys tomorrow because today I'm kind of like busy, like, you know, you know, doing my house chores. And I used to do my house chores on Sundays and now I do them on, on, sat on Saturdays. Just because I feel like I want to go Sunday, Monday, you know, I want to do Sunday and... Excuse me, guys. I just took my vitamins and I'm just like so like repeating them. I took them late. And I took them after my, my meal. So, I don't know. Maybe that's it. I usually take them early in the morning. And I was running around early in the morning. So, anyways, the reason why um, I'm coming on today was because I wanted to change her outfit. And, guys, I wanted to... Well, <laughs> I don't want to show you my address, but... I have two boxes that I received from um, Bountiful Baby. So, if I could find the knife, that would be excellent. Here we go. <coughs> Guys, you know, ever since I got, like, um, I got the Corona, like, you know, I got it, I think, in December. And I wasn't congested. I didn't get a fever or anything like that. But then now my body's been going through this thing where I have like an annoying cough. And I'm not congested. And I've been like doing home tests to see if like if I'm getting sick, right? Because my, my son got corona three times. He didn't get it like when he was deadly sick. The first time he was like, you know, he had like a cold. And all the, you know, of course he went through the whatever symptoms. And then the second time, he didn't even know he had it. He just tested positive. And then the third time, um, he was feeling cold symptoms. And my daughter, I don't know, he went to the house and I think he gave it to my daughter. I don't know. I don't know. You know, but then my daughter got corona recently. So, but my daughter hasn't been to my house and I miss her so much. Like, you know, I, I miss her so much. I mean, I've been going to see her. Like, I went to see her yesterday. I didn't go to see her. I seen her. <laughs> I went to drop her off, like, groceries. That's what I went to do. I dropped her off some groceries and stuff. 
but I, I you know I stood of course I stood away from her I kind of like dropped off the groceries and we were just like having this you know chat from a <laughs> distance and I was like oh my gosh that was kind of hard to be honest with you guys because you know I just want to hug her and love on her you know she's she's my bunny like she's my baby she's my sweetie pie like you know my daughter's so like oh she's she's a mama's girl like she really is she's um, she, she's, she's like a, she, you know, she's, she's my needy child, like, she, she loves on me, and I love on her, like, we love on each other, and we're always, like, she'll come stay over here for a couple of days, you know, um, she'll do that, like, every other week, or every, you know, but anyways, guys, yeah, so my cousin told me that, you know, when you get corona, like, it takes a, it takes certain amount of months she said it takes just about eight months for your system and then you know you start getting kind of like um kind of symptoms because your body's trying to kind of get rid of you know of the anti by anti whatever you know trying to get rid of whatever the heck it gave you or it's in the system but I think on my body's going through that. She said my niece is going through that as well. But I've been having like, um, like just cough, like little cough, like I've just been coughing. It's just so annoying because I, I just keep testing. I have like here in New York, they 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 give out they um they basically give out masks, hand sanitizer, and home home uh, test kits just about everywhere so i have a lot of them i'm just gonna scoot her over so that i can show you guys what i bought from bouncer food baby so yeah so anyway all right 